Hello my friends, Wayne here once again for Let's Play Kick Gaming Channel, bringing you part 3 of Dying Light on the Xbox One console. And already shit's hit the fan. I'm half dead, quite literally. I've already broke my weapon once, and during the break I found myself trapped on this van when I was waiting for my last video to export, so it's going to be interesting considering my original plan was to open the back of this van and hopefully get some loot. Now these bitches are like, nah lad, you ain't never doing that. We got more in the distance. Our objective for this uh, particular episode is to hopefully get in this van and then get the shot of Vantas in from Dr. Zia to stop us dying. But it's not going well because we've already alerted that horde. The fuck are them spikes? There's a zombie stuck on some spikes. So we've got a zombie stuck on some spikes. She's like, yeah, I've been on those shrooms. I've been on those fluorescent shrooms, bruh. So she's in a rave. She's like, yeah, I got all the munchies. Yes, fuck what, bro? He's really tall, and he's on a rave as well. So the zombies are already having a rave, and like, yeah. And we've only just started the episode, so I need to get in that van, and I refuse to be told what to do by some dead bitches. So we're gonna have to kill this guy, just because he was the one that was annoying me the most. For some reason. Oh, you fuck! Right, so I can search this guy's body quickly for more cigarettes. Let's kick this bitch. Oh shit, you got a spike through the tit. Oh, so I can use this to my advantage then. Hell to the fuck. Yes, get on there. That's one way to do it. Now he's got a spike through the bum hole. This is the worst. This is like one freaky orgy. And she f <laughs> she just fell over. She didn't even, I didn't even have to kick her. That one's dead as well. Right, so I've got a new way to kill zombies. <laughs> no, no. I've got a new way to kill zombies, but I'm already nearly dead. Press down on the D-pad to use a med kit. I knocked herself, look behind, and she fell over again. She's so fucked on shrooms. She has no idea where she is or what's going on. Right, walk into the spikes. She, she missed the spikes. Right, get on there. That's it, bro. Right, you get on there as well. Get on you, mate. Right, so we really are having one really fucked up zombie orgy right now. Yeah, bitch. You need to sex swing when you got spikes so you can both get murder and sex. Fuck yeah. Sixteen dollars. See, I even got paid to fuck that zombie. He's still... Look at his twitching. He's loving life. I got paid. This really is a messed up orgy. I'm getting paid for it now. Bitch be pimp! Yeah, boy! Look at it. They're all giving me money like Wayne that I've had the best time of my life. Take all my money. All the booze. More money. They're really all giving me all the money in fags. Cigarettes. Fags is British slang for cigarettes, guys. Uh, if, if that's what you're wondering. Oh my god, Wayne said fag. No. Wayne said fag is in cigarettes. You get what I mean, guys. Fag is British slang for cigarettes. I think Thorny bought that point up at one point. But yeah, bitch. <laughs> Thorny bought that point. Oh shit, she's on fire now. Not gonna go. Oh yeah. Baby. Baby. <laughs> right, that's enough of that. Off of your head, bitch. Oh shit, I actually took off her head. I took off her head. I've been paid in cigarettes, whiskey, and money for this bitching orgy. This is the best. Look at it. This is fucking brutal. I think I need to smoke a fag now. Can I even smoke them or are the crafting parts or wherever? Collectibles. You can't even smoke. Way to ruin my fun. I need to stop saying fag because people don't get that. They're like, cigarette is what we go for. Go for. So in this van, all we had was... Money. All we have with money. What else we got? You're already dead. You're not going to give me any loot. This van doesn't open. That that vehicle doesn't open. Right, let's head on the path to Dr. Zier. Cigarette in hand, bottle in other hand, and this pipe. And a shit ton of money that we can obviously spend on stuff at some point, I hope. Bro, where's your other half gone? Ah. Well, that didn't end, ba that didn't end well for you. Open this van. So we're going to need more metal parts. Metal parts are clearly to repair our weapons. As we fed it in the last episode when we used some to repair our pipe. Good stuff. This game rocks already. The fact that you can use the environment to your advantage is phenomenal as well. I wish Dead Island would have done that. It didn't end well for this guy. He just wanted to read a book or get a file and he got crushed. Worst way to die ever. What is this? Dr. Mark... Andrzy. Professional healthcare recommends. Cannot read that, bro. Right, I 
Let's get in here. Let's search this gaff. Ooh, we actually can search the gaff. What you got in your fridge? More booze. So apparently the people of this island do not eat food. They simply just live on booze. I don't know why I haven't been to this island before myself. The one thing that would make this marathon game run better right now is whiskey. Oh, dead out zombies and whiskeys. That's the key to all life's problems, those my friends. Look at that, we've got a few Z's down here. I reckon I can totally sneak up on these like some badass freaky ninja of death and fuck them up good and proper. <laughs> yeah, nice one, lad. Nice one. Look at them, they haven't even seen me. I'll get my, my ninja on. Get my ninja on! My stealth. Oh, peace to. Oh, never mind. Fuck ah! <laughs> Power level up, skill point acquired. Hell yeah! Hells to the yes. Right, so let's see what this is. Let's see what this is. You have skill points to spend. Select one of the skill trees to spend your points. Hold A to OK. So I can only spend the power skills in here. Oh, so I have to level up the other ones. Yeah, OK. The power tree allows you to face your opponents directly. To increase your power level, engage in combat, kill your enemies creatively, and use skills from the power tree. Gotcha. Hold A to OK. Let's see what we got. Oh, so this is the only one I can... Requires power level 3. Stun kill, kick stun, just regular stun. Each strike with a blunt weapon to an enemy's head has a chance to stun. Sturdiness, melee throw, multi throw, blast. Yeah. Power level 5. Uh, should I just go for stun? Kick stun sounds good though. Left bumper to execute. Requires skill stun. Oh, so they all require stun anyway, so I don't think I have much choice but to purchase stun. So let's go for it. Uh, skills, agility, where else we got here? Agility tree allows you to outrun your opponents to increase your agility level. <laughs> Not if I'm smoking as much as I've been given. One more cigarette and my lungs are done. To increase your agility level, perform climbs, jumps to, or other free running moves. Oh, sick. So you actually get, basically, you get rewarded for running and exploring. That is epic. Epic. How do we level up the survivor rank? Complete quests, help other survivors and participate in challenges. Gotcha. Right, so this is awesome. You literally get rewarded to do anything. So if I run and jump, I can get rewarded for agility as well. Is that right? Yeah! Look at that. More zombie clunge action. Damn bitch. That oh boy, let her get up. Love it. She's just not going to be able to get up at all. This guy don't even care, he's just standing around. He's like, I've got no arm, bro, I've got nothing to live for. I can't masturbate. Oh, yeah, so that's stunned her. So I can kick it down to the ground now. And she'd be fucked. I'll bash him in his dome. So I'm still getting points. How are you alive? I'm still getting points for melee damage as well, so that's awesome. I just killed three. No, I didn't. I knocked them down. Stay down, dickhead. Thank you. Get down. Get down, lad. Get down. I'm bitch whipping zombies in a junkyard. Kick the shit out of you, lad. Look at him. Right, there we go. So there's another head that's gone splat. He just swung the wrong way. Right, search. Cigarette. Seriously, you want me to level up my agility and you're giving me all these cigarettes to smoke? It really is. Just wrong. Especially when I'm trying to quit smoking. <laughs> IRL. Thanks, just rub it in. Smoking and gaming is just awesome. Smoking, drinking and gaming and... I'm trying to stop smoking, so... It's not gonna go too well for me when I'm... Playing this and there's just fags around every corner. The wust, lads. The wust. What are you doing? Oh, so this must, must be Dr. Zia's safe zone. Oh yeah, he lives on that van, doesn't he? So, right, we're already here. I didn't even know how we got there. But I want to get up here first. <coughs> some reason. I just feel like there's something up here. Look at it. You can actually climb on anything. You can be anywhere. This is OP. Look at that. We've got a Z there and a chest. I want to go and see what's in that chest. Usa. Let's see what we got. Batteries for a crafting part. Excellent. Right. I bet I can get over there. Yeah, because I can totally grab onto... He's just like, nah, fuck that. I've just seen what you've done to my boys in the junkyard. I'm committing suicide. And he jumps off the ledge. Good lad. Right, so I want to get him there. Yes, you actually can. You actually can. 
This is amazing, me. I know folks that have been watching videos or playing this themselves have been like, oh, Wayne, how are you getting amazed at all this? We've seen it all before. But no, I haven't. I really haven't. Oh, God. That guy's thinking of Jack in that car. I should probably do something about that. There's another guy. No, fuck it. Let's go to Dr. Z now. Let's get some story story mode activated. So, how do I get up there? Maybe it's... Maybe it actually it's like... Jump on here and then up over the fence or something. <laughs> Bitch, I'm a, I'll be free running. Oh, they just keep me out. Okay. They kept me out. Well, fuck yourself. <laughs> I'll do it my own way. Bitch! It's the best! It's the best! Yeah, she's so angry. Look at the faces! They're all twinsies! Oh man. Hold wide to repair weapon or switch to rusty pipe wrench. Yeah, switch the leg for now. Don't even be wasting all my metal parts. Like at this early in the game when I might not get any more for a while. Right, there's one body to search. Let's deal with these bitches first. Wait for my stamina to reheal, but kicking doesn't actually cost you any stamina from what I can gather, so just like it didn't in Dead Island, so smash your ass in. Yo, oh, yes, stunned it the fuck out of this guy. Get in the wall. Where did you come from? Right, so I've got two on me now. The combat is like kinda difficult to get used to at first, but I'm sure it'll become easier. It's it seems more fluent and less stiff than Dead Island did, so it's better. Much better. But still, it's like I'm trying to learn how to target correctly at the moment, so. Weapon is broken, how? Gee. <laughs> oh, look at it, he's just like, oh yeah. He's just eating his bum hole. This, uh, when, this is the orgy episode by the sounds of it. Orgy episode for everyone. Six dollar. Six dollar. Six dollar. Hell yeah. Kick that. Weapon is broken to change it, so I'll stick, I'll stick to my pipe wrench. Uh. I think that hammer thing is the durability or something, so I suppose we'll see it at some point. So all my weapons are now broken. How do I get in here? I probably have to climb, right? Up there. And yeah, it's going to be up there, isn't it? So if I aim at that, can I get up there? You yes, I can. Yes, I can. Uh, how do I get up that way? Ah, no, it doesn't matter. Entering safe zone. So does that mean we've unlocked this safe zone or what? Look at fake Dale up there, he's like, yeah, binoculars, can see everything. He's just looking for more zombie orgies. He's been clearly wanking over that zombie orgy I hosted over there. Boy, got issues. Right, so I want to get up there. How you doing, bro? Those rotting fuckers never figure out how to climb on top of a van. <laughs> rotting fuckers. You're in a safe area, so I can't kick him in the face. That's what I just tried to do. And now we got another Shane over here with a big ass gun. Can't get in the back of the van yet. Can I? No. Doctor? Hello? Anybody there? Camden, are you there? Damn it. Ah, uh, so I'm supposed to get a vaccine? What? No, no. Suppressant. It's called Antizen. Suppresses the symptoms here. Sit. Right, this guy's got antizen issues. Postpones the inevitable. Best the GRE could do. Inevitable? So there's no cure? Ah, drama. It's a variation of rabies. There's no cure right now, but you see, I've been running tests on both antizen and infected tissue. A cure is possible, definitely possible. Oh shit! You really think you can figure it Dr. out? Doctor Zia with his skills. Help? Yes, I think so. Uh, where did I put that injector? <laughs> I've stolen it. I'll just pickpocket it off in sector zero, where the outbreak first well broke out. We've been collaborating via radio. Oh, we gotta find that other doctor then, would clearly. Have made more progress if the connection were better. Also, if my a cigarette, earlier bro? experiments had borne fruit, I tried He's checking my nails, see. recombined yep. versions Oakley. of the virus into chunks of meat and leaving them around the city, hoping some of the infected would eat them, so I could observe and document the results. But they didn't. Uh, it bore no fruit. I'm ashamed that I wasted so much time on it. 
No reason to hold any antizen in reserve now. In any case... All right. I'm quite busy, so on your way now. What's Just kicked me out of the van. So we got a doctor trapped in Sector Zero from when the outbreak first happened. They've been connecting via radio, and they may potentially have a cure for Raheem, the outbreak. Zero which checked is a me out and gave me another variation shot. of rabies. Okay, great. That ought to hold you for a while, which is good because I'm starting to get used to the idea of bossing you around. So, time for a real trial. Worth Go a try. talk to Spike. You find him near Zero's truck. He's got the first real job for you. Right. So where is Spike? Spike is nearby on a truck, but I want to totally get up here first. Survivor rank up, skill point acquired, I'll spend that in just a moment. Shops and quartermasters have new inventory. Right. Uh, wah! I can't believe I made that. The, the combat, the, like, the mechanics of this game keep amazing me. Because I'm just taking the piss basically, and yet it still keeps doing it every time. Right, so I'm so close to an agility level as well. Uh, survival starter kit. Learn how to craft the most basic things needed for survival, including lockpicks, firecrackers, throwing stars, and, mo uh, and Molotov cocktails. Yes. <laughs> yes. All the yes. Right, so I'm going to craft the fuck out some Molotovs. And I want to get over there first. Picked up a blueprint. Search for component parts. I've just leveled up agility as well. Craft firecrackers. Uh, grapple. Dodge incoming attacks by jumping sideways or backwards. Move in the desired location, uh, direction and press right bumper to execute. I haven't got my glasses on. So why the words keep coming out a bit fox sometimes. Right, so we've just got that dodge ability. What's that? I can't believe it. Oh. Well, it works until you are on a ledge. Then you probably shouldn't do that. What do you mean use? How can I use that? <laughs> yeah, climb lampposts. You can climb lampposts. I'm going to climb this and smoke a cigarette on top. Or not. Trash piles, awnings, cars and even enemies lessen the impact of your full enemies, you say. I can jump on a zombie. Right, so where have we got to go? We've got to go this way now. What? What is she doing? What is she doing? Bitch, please get down. Stand down. I get them there. <laughs> get them. That's it. That's where you belong in the gutter, you hoe. Right, let's go then. So, am I going the right way or the? She got a boy. Alright, get them. Uh, so, I need to head to this geezer across the way. Uh, let's see if I can get there first. Where is he? Oh, he's still in the safe zone. So I've gone out the safe zone for no reason. Luckily, I can just jump my ass in the safe zone from there. So he's, he should be in here. Is he gone, bitch? Cigarettes everywhere. Thanks. How to ma help Wayne not quit smoking? Have a game that features only cigarette drops and people smoking cigarettes. This ought to be called Cigarette Simulator and Orgy Simulator. Spike, hello. Spike, I'm Crane. Just what I need. More unskilled labor. Bitch, I'm OP right, compared to you, up lad. And pay attention. There are two types of airdrops. One is food, first aid supplies, survival gear, and such. The other kind is filled with antizen. The GRE sends in a one-way video feed that lets us know when they're on the way. Look, the trouble is, the airdrops with antizen keep getting raided by Rise's thugs. And without antizen, we're basically screwed. Rise and his boys only operate during the day because going out after dark is a dandy way to get killed. But the next two antizen drops are coming down right at sunset tonight and Brecken means to go after them. This may be our only chance to reach the airdrop. Right. What's my part here? Well, as I said, going out at night is basically suicide. Or it would be if I hadn't been setting up safe zones and traps out there for weeks now. So you always go at night, right? Now, Brecken and his team will be okay tonight so long as you get out there now and arm those traps. That's your part. All right. What are these traps and how do I arm them? You'll see. I'll be talking you through it. Just remember, without these traps, Brecken won't survive the night, and if he doesn't come back with Antizen, we are lost. Easy! Before you head out there, grab some firecrackers. Made them myself. They make a fine distraction if you get in trouble. Thank you. Oh, distraction items. So, just like State of Decay, firecrackers to uh, distract the Z's. 
I can change my equipment, so I've got the firecrackers equipped now. I've still got four metal pots. Let's head into the blueprints. Molotovs. So I need one alcohol and one string. So I need to find some string. We need blades and string to make throwing stars. And alcohol and string to make molotovs. Now I'm assuming fire is going to be really boobs. I assume fire is going to be really boobs again. Really useful in uh, crafting things. For what? I assume that molotovs and fire in general is going to be a great way to kill disease in this game because they seem to be dumb asses enough look looting is the key to survival search dead bodies chests abandoned cars pieces of furniture and even trash bins to find crafting components weapons and cash hold a to use your survivor sense to identify objects you can loot okay search the environment for huge lot chests left by other survivors they're usually placed on rooftops beyond the reach of zombies and contain weapons or other valuable things search dead bodies check offer you know that one lad Right, so hold A. Ah, yes! Epic! So there's something across the way there. So I want to bounce my sweet booty over here. Uh, I want to switch out to my weapon that's not broken, so I'm not going to repair it just yet. Convenience store. Can I get, get in there, maybe? Let's hold A again. 52 meters. What the fuck was that? Oh! Nothing that. Right, so. We want to head now to wherever the hell that blip was on the map. 36, 34, so it's over here. But I'm bringing this with me just in case. I wonder if you can throw your weapons like in Dead Island as well. Cause that'd be okay. good. First, the car. Open the hood, connect the battery, and on the trap. Okay. Can I actually throw my weapon? No, that's... Oh yeah, that'll attract attention! Look at... Oh no! Right, okay. I was trying to see if I could throw my weapon, but apparently not. Prepare a trap for Brecken's mission. Jade here. Is anyone outside right now? Urgent help needed. Ah. Um, I'm outside. I'm working for Spike. Money in a phone box. You're crying, right? Listen, our runner's trying to secure one of our safe houses for Brecken's mission. He's in a courtyard by Zephyr and Mimar, surrounded by zombies. We gotta help him. I'm on my way. Alright, I'm on it. Help the trap survivor, so it is this way anyway. Can I aim with this or not? Or I can kick with it. I missed. <laughs> oh shit! I still knocked him down. Move. Right, I'm having that back by the way. Oh fuck balls! Shit! Cock! Right, move. I'm taking this with me. Oh no, forget it. Right, this should be funny. Ooh! <laughs> Jeez, that is one hench little tool. Any loots, 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 loots? No, I'm off anyway then. No! Get up! Jeez, I really need to learn these these combat mechanics a lot better. Loots? No loots in the area that I can see anyway. Right, so I definitely need to learn these controls a little bit better before I can piss around as much as I like to in zombie games. Uh, no loots. No! Nothing. Still, let's carry on. Help the trap survivor. Now apparently, landing on zombies will break your fall. So if I can attract this little bitch over here, I'm totally going to test that out. Oi, bellend. Come here, lad. Ooh, a weapon, a floor plank. Right, I'm not going to make that. Can I pick up those bricks, I wonder? No, but I can pick up another plank, maybe. Let's, that, let's have a look. No, 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 no. Oh, jeez, he's eating his dinner. Look at him having a right nosh on that poor man. Well, what's left of him anyway? There's the long Z, so we should be alright if we just drop down and run to the location. In fact, I could totally sprint and kick that guy in the face. What's up? Look at him, what are you even wearing, lad? Fashion 101, don't wear that. You deserve to die for that outfit. <laughs> You're still going to die for that outfit. Oh, spiky now. Poor man. More cigarettes. What? Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. <laughs> right, okay. Let's go. What's in here, though? Loot. Yeah, hell yeah. More money in there. Money. What can I even spend money on, though? What are we going here? Back, back lover? Back lover? 
I don't know even know how to say that, but I've eaten it. I don't know what it did, I think it might have given me a... Uh, might have given me some... Fuck! <laughs> Give me some hit points or something! Did that... Shit! Jesus! I should probably stay upstairs on the roof or something. Loot! No loots? Oh, many loots apparently. There's a chocolate bar. Yeah, that heals my HP. Oh, oh. Jeez, let's not go that way. Into. I need to get back onto something. As I'm not going. <laughs> the crowd! Make, make it through the crowd! Punch it right in the face, lad! Jeez! Jesus! Where's the roof? Where's the roof? Why am I not on the roof? Get me up! Get me up! No shit, he's surrounded by zombies! Fuck! Right, can I get over there? I'm sure I can. So this geezer's surrounded by zombies. All two of them. Mate, bitch please, I've got about 50 on me. Right, okay, let's get him. here, along with some infected. Watch yourself, Chris. Hey, I'm surrounded by two zombies. And neither of them have arms. Grow up. They sound so stealthy. Right. Bitch! Fucking! Let him out! What a stun. What a stun. I always forget that zombies have skeletons. Right. <laughs> Stay down! Stay down! Fuck! Son of a god! Ugh. Fucking tramp! Look at you! Death to your wound! God! Yeah! Right, that's one way to do it. Metal parts, so I can repair some weapons. And 19 dollars! Here we got here. A dwarf. Right, where else we got around here? Another table leg, I'll take that. Thank you very much, sugar tits. A floor plank, take that. A nailed plank! I've got a board with a nail in it! Yes! Right, I want to equip the ball with a nail in it. Wrong button. Still getting used to the controls, guys. Don't forget, first time I played. So, we're just getting used to this bit by bit. Nail plank. 19 damage. So it's just the same as everything else, really. So, I want to equip that instead of the pipe. Now, let's get the nail. <laughs> yes. Run! He's got a board with a nail in it. Right, lad, you in. Lad. Lad. Oh. Drama! All the drama! Right, but we are 30 minutes in, my friends, which means we shall continue and see what the hell has happened to this guy in episode number four. I hope you're enjoying the series so far. This game is so much fun, it's unbelievable. Um, I've paid £55 for this, so I really hope you guys enjoy the videos as much as I'm enjoy enjoying the game. We're apparently with no 0% in the storyline, just from pissing around. This has been a really fun episode. It's been the kind that's showed me what's to come, so to speak, in the way that we can kill zombies, the beginning roots of leveling up our skills, finding new weapons, crafting, all sorts. I'm very much looking forward to carrying on with it. And the fact that you can use the area, there's unlimited supplies of cigarettes and alcohol, so Oasis would be very happy. And not so much for me when I'm trying to quit smoking, but whatever, whatever. And you can use the environment to kill zombies with. Zombies on a spike. We just hosted one freaky fucked up zombie orgy. And it was glorious. It was glorious, my friends. It was glorious. So thank you for watching. I shall see you shortly for part number four. We'll find out what ha what's happened to this guy trapped in the van. And yeah, everything is going down. Shit is hitting the fan. Awesome. All the best, my friends. Have a good day. And goodbye.